there, Glastonbury Whole Food Market Facebook foodie fans. It's Cooking Made Easy with me, Andrea. Um, and today we're gonna do smoothies. We're gonna do berry smoothies. Um, I know this is the year for everybody to change their dietary habits and get in shape, and I know for myself, I'm one of them. Um, and smoothies is something I just learned the other day, and I think they're great. And to help me out with this segment today is my friend Ben. Come on in, Ben. Hi, Andrea. Hi. Could you tell everybody who you are and what you do here? Yeah, sure. Um, one of the things I do here at Whole Foods Market is help people make healthier decisions about their diet and their lifestyle. So I'll be talking to you a lot. Yeah, well, absolutely. <laughs> yeah. So, so uh, one of the things we're going to talk about today is the, the fruit smoothies. And, and what I'm going to be using is banana, berries, peaches and um, blackberries and strawberries and these these are frozen these are frozen and this is probably easier for people at home because they're just they're there in your freezer for pretty much the whole season right and you don't have to worry about the expense of right fresh stuff and it's going bad and mm -hmm. not only that though but the but the uh, the frozen fruits are frozen in their peak freshness so you're gonna get really high quality fruit very nice nice to know <clears throat> mm -hmm. we're also gonna be using almond milk and which is a nice substitution for a regular cow's milk it's lower in fat it still has protein and some good fats to help help you keep satisfied after I know about an hour after. So you have no worries if you're lactose intolerant. It's got nothing to do with right. any kind of issues. No lactose, just as long as you don't have an almond allergy or anything. Oh, okay. <laughs> that's well. That's a good thing to know too. If you have it yeah. now, this is a tree nut. A uh, tree nut, right? But you know, if you have any allergies, you can try coconut milk or rice milk or we have, we have probably a dozen different types of milks. You Great. Can try. All right. So, do we want to get down and make these? Let's do it. All right. All right, so I guess you're gonna start with what? Your liquid in the bottom? Yeah, it's always good when you're making a smoothie to start with the liquid, it helps it blend better. So I'm gonna pour the almond milk probably around a cup, um, and that's gonna go right to the blender. And if you like it thinner or thicker, obviously you're gonna use more of the liquid. Exactly. Now could you use water too? You can use water as well. Um, you know, it may not, may not sustain you as long as, as you'd like if you use water, because there's some fat and protein in there that's really gonna help. Okay, great. Uh, next ingredient, we're going to use a banana. I like using uh, really ripe bananas. That's kind of a secret of mine because they're they're freckled and they're much higher in sugar. Um, and because the brown spots are actually the sugar, right? That's, that's it's an indicator of the sugar, right? Nice. Um, I'm just going to throw those right to the banana. You don't even have to chop them up. You can kind of put them in. They're going to they're going to get blended up anyway. Um, and as for the the fruits, other fruits we're using, um, I have some frozen uh, blueberries here that we're going to throw in. And what are those good for? What are blueberries for efficiency? Blueberries are some of the highest antioxidant fruits out there. And so these antioxidants can help with anything from healthy skin, healthy heart function, um, metabolism, digestion, the list goes on and on. So, Great, so it's a very powerful little thing to put in your smoothie. Mm -hmm. And this is about maybe three, three quarters of a cup of uh, frozen blueberries. Uh, next one is, is peaches. And these are frozen peaches again. Um, and you know, because we're in the middle of winter here, we can't get fresh peaches, so frozen is a good option. So stock up. Mm -hmm. And this is a, probably about a half cup or to like three quarters of a cup of the frozen peaches. Um, and then the last one um, is our mixed berries that we, we sell in the frozen department um, here at Whole Foods and they have uh, blackberries, uh, wild blueberries, and strawberries. So uh, the reason why we're using so many fruits today is because each fruit has different nutrients and different antioxidants that are going to help for you know a wide variety of different things. And it'll help you get through the winter, mm -hmm. lose weight, get on track. Absolutely. So we're just going to throw those into the blender and, and blend these up. And we're done. Nice. Now this is pretty thick, so mm -hmm. I'm not a real thick person. So I would just add a little bit more of this almond milk. Absolutely. Oh, great. <laughs> like it out there. Um, you can see a really nice color to it, uh, dark purple, that's all the antioxidants in there. So you know you're really getting something healthy for you. Mm, I can taste that you don't need to add any sweetness either, which is really nice. It's all natural from the fruits. Yeah, I mean there's no no added sugar, no added fat, you know, it's, it's really, really healthy recipe. So people that are on a Health Starts Here program, whether it's, you know, their own program or a program that's regimented, this is definitely something that falls into their criteria of Hey, you can have this. When you come to the store and, and you know you see the Health Starts Here logos, you know it's a way to know that the food that you're eating is going to be really healthy, and this is definitely something that complies with the Health Starts Here program. It's really great. It's very refreshing, and it feels like summer, mm -hmm. and it's and it's winter, so that's cool. Easy to do too. 
Yeah, it took what? Less than five minutes. Mm -hmm. I would say you could probably make this in less time than you can make your coffee. Yeah, absolutely. Awesome. Well, thanks so much, Ben, for all your uh, information today and these awesome smoothies. You're welcome, my pleasure. Great, thank you so much. So thanks for joining me today and follow me on my journey of getting back into shape and my pre-mommy body, which is going to be a really lot of fun. I have a blog out right now, which I'd love for you guys to start following me. It's called The Big Decision and it'll be posted on our Facebook page. So cheers 